Roswell Flight Test Crew here in CES 2015 in Las Vegas, Nevada. And I'm talking to Matthew from Hexo Plus. How are you doing, Matthew? Hey, I'm doing good. Good, nice good, good. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. So tell us about your product here. So it's a flying autonomous camera that uh, anyone can use. You don't need to be a, a, a drone enthusiast or, or a geek. If you know how to use a smartphone, then you have all we need to use it. It will be all yours in few touch on a smartphone. Now, Matthew, we're seeing a lot these days the helicopters with the follow me capability. You know, where, where you get a launch and it'll follow your arm. But this is more sophisticated than that. Is that is that right? Yeah, exactly. Like uh, we had a successful Kickstarter campaign, and we had uh, like over uh, 2,000 people uh, part of our community backing the project, and also a great team of ambassadors, like professional athletes, Olympic gold medalists. Do DIY movie makers and talking to those guys and having them use our prototypes, we understood that uh, follow me is good, and uh, we want to provide them more than a simple move. And uh, there is uh, many camera move that we're working on and that we have already in our app, and uh, those camera movements allow them to uh, capture various types of footage. That's the next level, basically. Huh? Well, it's already uh, available for pre-order on our website exoplus.com, and it comes with a discount, so I would recommend people to uh, try that out and check the website to get more information also. And um, we will start shipping this summer, uh, the backers that uh, supported us during the Kickstarter campaign, and then pre-order will come next, and around Christmas we will uh, hit the shelves. All right, outstanding. Now what's the flying time on this unit? What kind of battery are you using? Uh, it's, uh, the flying time is uh, 15 minutes. So you've got an app here which allows you to control different camera moves. Yeah, it works, uh, as I was mentioning, the only thing you do is a smartphone. So if you know how to use a smartphone, you just can use the, the app and you select the, the movements you want to you wanna use. Let's say you are at the top of a mountain and you want to do a 360 selfie. So you just click on 360 selfie, it opens different settings. Uh, you can define uh, the position where the camera will be at when it starts. So it can be from the side, on the back, on the left side, or facing you. Then you go to framing, so it can be far away from you, so you're little in the picture, but also you can be closer. So there is a intermediate also framing. And then you can decide where you will put the camera. So it will be either uh, on the flat, like facing you at the eye level. Uh, it could be at 45 degrees angle, or right above your head. And then you can uh, select if you want it clockwise or counterclockwise. So once you've done that, you press launch and you get the camera to fly around you and record footage that you wouldn't have been capable of uh, getting. So can you have it follow you while it's executing one of these camera moves? Yeah, of course, of course it can. Because the connection with the GPS uh, from the, the smartphone is always on. So if you move and select a 360 selfie, it will just be a 360 moving selfie, and that's perfect. <laughs> Is this going to have the ability to fly it manually? Yeah, of course, it's compatible with RC, and we will be offering RC on our website a couple months before we ship the Exo Plus to our backers. And uh, we're trying to get a good deal for them <laughs> with a different man manufacturer. So uh, I would recommend them if they're into uh, buying Exo Plus and uh, want to buy your RC to wait a little, and uh, we'll give them all the info. All right. Well, Matthew, thank you so much. Looks like a great product. Look uh, forward to seeing it in the air. Thank you for having us. Oh, absolutely. Absolutely. All right. And from uh, CES 2015, this is the Roswell Flight Test Crew signing off.